The Jacid and Monkey Sanctuary, an eco-tourism attraction site in the Doma Central Municipality of the Buni region, could hold the key to boosting the fortunes of the local tourism industry. The potential of the Monkey Sanctuary has, however, not been fully exploited. Portia Gabor was there and has more in the following report. Any first-time visitor to Diasidan would be captivated by the picturesque and serene environment. The farming community in the Doma Central Municipality of the Bono region is close to the border of La Cote d'Ivoire. It is about 10 kilometers along the western end of the Doma Gunukrum Road. We are currently at the Diasidan Forest and we understand there is an untapped tourism potential here. We understand there is a monkey sanctuary here. So let's get inside and see what's in store for us. The key to having a memorable time at the Diasidan Monkey Sanctuary is to go along with a bunch of banana. The path through the Monkey Sanctuary will charm you as you trek along through the forest. With tour guides acting as local caretakers, the device means to invite the monkeys. The serene atmosphere with the chirping of the birds and crickets, it is almost like paradise, a place where nature is at peace. The path through the sanctuary leads through the forest to a large bamboo grove which is home to hundreds of monkeys. There are over 800 monkeys located here in this monkey sanctuary. Unfortunately, this area is an untapped tourism potential. Authorities here are calling on investors to come to this community to help explore the tourism potentials in this community. The natural habitat has been preserved by residents. History has it that a chief Kofi Isidu regularly traveled through this forest on hunting expeditions to feed his people. On one of such adventures, he was caught up in a huge storm. Unable to return, he sought shelter under a tree. Later, he decided to relocate his people to the tree that provided him with shelter from the storm. With time, monkeys joined the inhabitants and lived together in harmony. There are three different species of monkeys in Dryasidan and considered sacred and therefore they are not to be harmed or killed. Locals have given them special names like John, Agatha, Abrewa, Akus and Mephia and when they die there is land reserved for their burial. Despite the tourism potential, the site is not fully developed. Well, he said they had to, he used to say, say, mube buaye, mube hunde uru. I'm a man forty. Be huni I woha. It be an abin be free be beer to me. A bebo am an I come I'm appealing to government to help develop this tourist site. It will bring development to this town. I did your hook a crap. Now I say, PC cry, we are bookers, because you say, Hi, come up. Which me a better now. Sabby, Sabby, a school for a crab between a bar better than her siandi. It's in a mobile boy, I beat me a boama. We want to develop this place into a tourist attraction area. Um, so you are seeing the monkeys for yourself. They are very friendly. Uh, we don't harm them. They are our friends. So it attracts a lot of visitors anytime they come to town. So that's our appeal to the general public. Um, as an assembly, we have all the plans, you know, except that uh, um, we are waiting for the funds to develop it. So we are calling on investors to come over to support us in that direction. There is the need to develop the monkey sanctuary to generate revenue for the Doma Central Municipal Assembly and to create employment for rural dwellers. This is my first time coming actually hearing about this place. I love this place. It's kind of cool and I wish you come here more often. Next time you visit the Bono region, make sure you visit the Dracidan Monkey Sanctuary to boost Ghana's local tourism industry. Hello monkey, say hello to TV3. Poshigabo, TV3 News, Dracidan, Bono region.